GTR and there are a couple of showers around South Florida at the moment, especially in Broward County. Watch your driving partly cloudy, the forecast and a slight chance of some showers. High of 82, 63 degrees now, Miami, West Palm, and Fort Lauderdale. I'm not in shape, I used to be. Playboy magazine's party school number one might be for
just be careful, baby. This is like fucking an inner tube. Oh, jeez. <laughs> you always know the right thing to say. You know what I mean? going on here? Why are you breaking into my house? Uh, that's a good question. You know that? You're great. I love you. Mm. You see, someone took the key from under the mat. The key. Oh, whoops, sorry. <laughs> What are you doing here? Why aren't you home? Hey, Pete. Why aren't you anywhere but here? You're starting to piss me off, Roger. You know that? I'm out. That's all. Okay? I was so alone and I had no I just thought, I just thought I'd bump down on the old couch risky, you know? Mm. I'm sorry. Why aren't you home with Denise? Denise? Oh, God. <laughs> Cat, you wouldn't believe it. I'm out. Seven years of marriage. It's over. <laughs> Do you want to talk about it? No. Not now. Okay. Why don't you just stay in the couch? What, are you leaving? Yeah. Ain't love grand.
make sure the gear is still rolling. Who else is going to go? Squash. What? Well, She's absolutely stark fucking naked. Is running around the house like a fairy princess, waving a magic wand. <laughs> but she's absolutely ignoring her old lady, and she's screaming at the top of her lungs. No, no, no! And I'm giving it to her. Woo, woo, woo! I mean, what the hell? Whatever happened to romance? <laughs> and listen, I told her. I said, listen. Gravity is all around us. Don't knock the gravity. Puts food on the table. Anything goes nowadays, you know? Nobody's got any decency. You got no character. Free for all. Look at you. What happened last night is none of your business. I don't sleep around. You know me better than that. Yeah, I know. Besides, it's none of your business. Said that. Well, I meant it. Why don't we start at the beginning? Is someone else involved? You've been drifting apart for some time now. And you said as much. Nothing in common anymore, different goals. You know, try some different things together. Right, he's the spice of life. Yeah, well, how come you're divorced? Huh? Because Variety was not Howard's middle name. Those captains here don't stick work. Fine day, isn't it? Sun is shining, breeze is warm. It's the perfect day to catch the grammar masses of that digital little fingers in the cookie jar. Isn't it, Giuliani? Yeah. Right. Right. Oh, good. I have a real gory one for you. Just came in. Don't bother with breakfast. Give them something to talk about. <laughs> you wouldn't believe it. And then, no, 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 no. Get this. And then she calls her sister on the phone to come over so we can do it. <laughs> what did you do, fucker, dog, too? Huh? Hey, it's one of us. Hey, what are you, faggot or something? How you don't Save like girls? Save it for the street slam, Giuliani. Wait a minute. Hold on. Wait. Wait a minute. Listen. Listen. Maybe you should talk to someone about this. We were. We were. You didn't say a thing. I will. When? When I feel like it. Why don't you feel like it now? Because I'm pissed off. Then you should talk to me about it. No. God. Like I said, you should see a pro. I can talk to you. You are driving me crazy too. You should see a pro. A hooker? A shrink. <laughs> no. Suit yourself. Hello, 
What is that? Oh, huh? Looks foreign. No. Yeah, I'd say Mexican or somewhere Spanish. Does he look Mexican? Looks like some sort of religious stuff. Yeah. Maybe the poor bastard was praying for his life. You know, there's no sign of struggle. How come there's not more blood? I mean, it, it, it looks like it was easy, like he let it happen. Looks like his head was uh, burned off or cauterized. Yeah. Oh, what do we have here? Well, it's not your homegrown variety. Nigeria. Yeah, there's a pocket of Nigerians in this neighborhood, a couple of thousand maybe. It's a place to start anyway. Okay. Bag this puppy. Uh, I gotta make a call. Is there, is there a phone around here? Should I call her? Sure. What are you going to say? Listen, let's finish up here first, OK? And then you can call. Maybe we'll, we'll find this guy's head around here somewhere. That would be nice, huh? Just gonna grab my clothes and some stuff. Oh, I'm not gonna be long. Can I talk to the niece? Boxes in the living room. Oh, you, you want to take my shirt too? I mean, how about my bra? Well, what about my shirt you're wearing and my my sweats and my socks? What do you want me to do, strip? Well, why not? We're about friends. Christ, you two were fast. But it's not even cold. Just like I was never here. I didn't mean it that way. It's just that this is the way it is. Well, I ain't talking to you, okay? You know, there's something indecent about this thing. The whole thing, you know. There ain't no discussions. There ain't no nothing. That's bullshit. We talked and talked to a blue. Well, I guess we didn't talk about the right things, huh? Something's not resolved. Hey, keep your hands off my stuff! You just stay out of this and get out of my way! Don't you come in here shoving us around like you own this place! I do own the place! You own half the place! No, it doesn't do any fucking good no, it doesn't do You shut up! I fucked you! You 
It's like you ought to know these things, you know. Come on. We got police work to do. Yeah. Take a deep breath, you'll feel a lot better. <sighs> uh, I gotta get a grip, you know. <laughs> Give it some time. Maybe you should take off some days that you've got coming to you. Life comes so damn cheap. Well, some people don't think they have much to lose. Maybe they don't. What you got there, Joe? Not much. Just blood. Listen, 
You know, you're never going to forget Denise. You'll adjust. We all do. Hey, look at me. Have I adjusted or what? <laughs> and then so. Damn right. Now. Criminal investigation. Yeah. Well, it seems to me that we can logically assume we have another African connection. Now, why is that? Huh? Politics? Drugs? Maybe. Or religion, some sort of infighting. Uh, intimidation, whatever, our purpose making a solid point, you know? Well, all we can do is wait for the forensics report, compare it to the other one, and go from there. Get Giuliani out here. Well, we're in a different world with this baby. Right back. Mm -hmm. Studies, University of Miami. What's all this? Field trip? I am the shaman, their spiritual leader and healer. We are of the same tribe, Igbo most of them. Their friends and families have found refuge here. But no more. It is here. You know the man who did this? He's not your man. He's our curse. Now he's your curse, too. Okay, well, I don't think this is a place to talk about it, okay? All right, you come to my office. We'll talk about it there. I'll be right back. We want to kill him, Mr. Juru. We're not interested in enlightenment. I know what a threat is, but I cannot help. Could you say that again in English, sir? I know what a threat is, but I cannot Why help. Why not? It is beyond my power. What the hell are you talking about, huh? These deaths and the ones to follow. Follow? More. Mm. What? What is that? He has come to reclaim the souls that have escaped his reach. These Igbo haven't just immigrated to America. They fled for their lives. More and more, every year, they use any and all means to escape the terror at home and come to this free land. Escape what? Chikati Tumo, the most powerful Orisha. A devil, if you will. That's a lot of bullshit. Its power comes from the human spirit. The planets rotate around the sun in an eternal orbit. Chikati Tumo is like an evil sun with its own gravity. Very strong, very deep. I don't expect you to believe me. Focus, focus. He sees potential here. A much larger universe. Sounds more like a corporate takeover than a murder. Why heads? To separate the mind from the body. The head is his to keep and to nourish with the human spirit within. Exorcist time, kids. It's bullshit. Excuse me, excuse us. Can we talk fine, outside? Fine, fine. Let's get out of here. Jesus. You two have to cut through the bullshit. If it wasn't him, he certainly knows who it was. I said let him spend the night in the can. Keep an eye on him. Yeah, well, what do you want to, what do you want to charge him with? Who cares? Nothing. Maybe he'll think of something that makes a lick of sense. Just book this. You book this guy. Can you handle it? Yeah, sure. 
go book him. You book him? Hey, hey, I don't care who books him or where he spends the night, just as long as it is supervised. You can take him home with you if you want. Well, I don't have a home. I'll book him. Too bad. Thanks for your concern. What are you talking about? That's what I thought. And I see I can't talk to you about anything. Just get cracking. Report to me in the morning. See if this medicine man coughs up anything. Why is this so hard? He is a real life suspect. I don't know. You think so? I don't know. He knows more than we know. Maybe he'll give us more in the morning. Maybe. I'll make sure you get the cell next to him. Maybe the perception is as important as the reality here. What? Well, I mean, if these people believe, really believe, that there is an unstoppable force that will cause them a great deal of pain and an ugly death, then the result is still the same. They're still not going to talk to us. Yes, but that really doesn't answer my question, does it? Well, sometimes strange things happen that have no logical explanation. Believe me, there is an answer for everything. I wish I was so sure. You're full of shit. Oh, and who made you the authority on everything? So, uh, why didn't we ever fool around, huh? Because you're an asshole. Is that the only reason? No. I was just being kind. How kind? <laughs> Go to sleep. Hey, look. I know I'm no day at the beach, but, you know, I got... got something. Yeah. You have something. I don't know what, but something. Good night. Good night.
Purify your soul, sister. Stepping into the joy, and I'm gonna leave all that jungle darkness behind. slamming the door to a classic car. No, you look pretty snappy today. Did I mention that? Are you in the right place? That looks like the right place to me. Mm -hmm. Mr. Juru. What is it? We're, we're here to speak to Mr. Juru. We're expecting you. Wow. Out, huh? We're in the wrong business, baby. No I'm kidding. Are you gonna buy me a car like that if I'm good? <laughs> Pretty nice place you got here. In my capacity as educator, I move freely between the two cultures that are a part of me. This teaching job must be pretty good, huh? Had you known about my standard of living, would you still have put me in jail? Or perhaps your paranoia is so great that you would have suspected my crimes also included burglary? <laughs> Come, let us walk in the garden. Killing. I'm not surprised. Yeah. Let's go through this head on her number again, okay? I believe I explained to you that the head hunter derives his power from these executions, physically and otherwise. How? Otherwise. Simple enough intimidation. Believe or lose your head. Logic I can understand. In other religions, you can be forgiven. In this one, you are punished. I offer you a drink. Inside. He's 
a chameleon. He adapts to his environment. So is he, is he just going to keep killing until there's no one left? Or until he has command over his congregation. Until he has a willing order ready to obey. One more may die or 100. Look. You've got to help us find him. What if you do? We kill the son of a bitch. It's either him or us. If you stand in his way, your life is destined to end as have those victims. He gravitates towards those who maintain the most resistance. Are you telling me we're a target too? Yes. This conversation, my allowing you into my home for this purpose, has posed a real threat to my life also. Tell me something. Are you a religious person? Do you take the Bible for the literal truth? Like what? Do you, for instance, believe the virgin birth of Christ? What, what does this have to do with anything, huh? Exactly. How do you expect to understand our religion when you don't even know your own? So there. Wait a minute. This is nuts. You have got to help us find this thing. You have got to help us beat it. I've told you all I know. The administrator is blaming MTV and Playboy magazine for helping fuel these riots. About 200 students arrested with uh, campus administrators promising they're going to consider canceling next year's celebrations. Well, over here on the religious front, we find that the TV journalists, Playboy magazine's party school number one. Think about it. I mean, somebody's got these people too scared to piss in the dark. I mean, things just don't happen the way these people say, you know? We gotta keep an open mind, don't we? Hi. Thank you. Hey, Raj. How long have you been waiting? Oh, about 10 minutes. What took you so long? Oh, you know, the usual. Well, are you just going to stand there? Are you going to come in and have a drink with us? Come on, my beer's getting warm. Come on, Pete. Uh, be right there. Come on inside. OK, I'm coming. Watch those peanuts to give you bad breath. Here you go. Know. Thanks. I'm gonna go look for him. You want me to go with? Sure. All right. Well, I'll see you. Where the hell is he? All right, I'm gonna go up here. You go and see if he's coming around the other way. Okay, I'll meet you back around.
shit. Black suit come through here, huh? I 
What do you mean? I told her I got here! Jesus, let's get you to a hospital. Pete. No broken bones. Hey, what's happening, guys? <laughs> Okay, let's go check this out. Check what out? Watch it. Okay. <laughs> you dago sure are messy eaters. Coming up with anything yet? Nothing that you don't understand. What's the problem? The problem is we got too much ground to cover. People are gonna keep showing up dead. Look at what, what we need is more manpower. These people are shutting up tighter than clams. Honey, if they're not talking, what good is more manpower gonna do? It's going to show we care, that maybe we're protected, uh, that we're committed to protecting their fucking neighborhood. And maybe, maybe, they'll talk to us. What are you, what are you looking at? Giuliani, to these jungle dwellers, it's just like home. Some survive, some don't. Law of the jungle, you know? Look, if these murders are taking place three blocks south of here, we can hear the fucking rattle of the jewelry. You'd have the National Guard turned out. Admit it! You'd have the fucking National Guard turned out. You're saying I'm not doing my job. What Pete is trying to say is that we just need more help. What I'm saying is two sets of rules for the same game. Juliana. They are just Negroes. And they are not even all Negroes. So just do the fucking job. to be dead. Well, you did come pretty close. It's not something a cop likes to be reminded of. Yeah, well, I can't help that. I know. But you have to admit, being pushed out of a window is an experience that'll raise the curiosity in anybody. I don't like the attention. Roger is coming over tonight. He's worried about me. That's sweet. You coming? Nah. I'll stay out of your way. I'm a good roomie. You okay? Yeah. Guys like this don't go on forever. We're gonna get him. We're gonna get him. Yeah.
Chad, it's me. I pulled down some extra duty tonight. I'm sorry. Uh, I, I won't be able to make it, but um, I'll be thinking about you. All of you. Cat, I hope you get this. Uh, it's me, Pete. Anyway, I got an idea, so I'm following up. Uh, there's something down here you should see. I'm at the old railroad yard, uh, just off Flagler. I'll be in there somewhere, so I'll uh, look for your lights, okay? Hurry, you'll find me. Come on. Pete, where are you? I'm through the door. Pete, keep talking to me. Come on. I want to show you something.
it's you. How else would I be? Freeze! Look. It's me. It's me. I heard the message on your machine. It was supposed to be me. It wasn't me. So I ran right over here, okay? What the hell's going on? Dolphins are lousy this year. Mets won the World Series. Your ex-husband's hung like a mouse. My wife, my wife likes women. <laughs> Come on, what more, what more proof do you need? Come on. Hey, and you won't mind if you walk in front of me and keep your distance. I shot a man right there. Now he's gone. Christ, we are not capable of handling this. I mean, there were people chasing me with torches and robes on. I mean, there they were, and then they weren't there. Shit, I killed a man right there, and now he's gone. Maybe, maybe they brought him here. Shit, Pete, what are we gonna do? What? What? Run, hurry. Uh, Hope you doesn't uh, want any dogs. Fucking guy probably owns a tiger. Police officers breaking and entering. So? So, be careful. Look, look, got any better ideas? Chime in. I will. Good. Jesus, look at this. It's really a shame he died. That's what? We're next.
Who are they? Robert Sinclair, Florida Atlantic University. What room is he in? Sixteen. Come in. Excuse me, are you Professor Sinclair? Sorry, Professor Sinclair, number 44. Thank you. Sorry. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Detective Cat Hall. This is Detective Pete Giuliani. We would not have bothered you today if it wasn't important. Oh, it's, it's not bother. Can I offer you some tea? Thank you. I, I would love some. And you? Uh, no, thank you, sir. Go on in. Say hello to my wife, Margaret. Can't speak. When you uh, telephoned me, you uh, mentioned one of my books. Yes, sir. Life Among the Tribes. We're particularly interested in the chapter dedicated to the severing of heads. Would you care for a biscuit, officer? Uh, no, thanks. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm OK. Decapitations. Are you referring to the murders I've been reading about? Yes, sir. We've done a little research on our own, and what we've come up with closely compares to the chapter that you wrote on Chikati Tumo. I see. It seems impossible. This to occur in Miami is unthinkable. Well, how about this? We've got a pocket of Nigerians who have fled their villages and immigrated to Miami. Why? Well, it seems that they were trying to flee something. And uh, it's followed them. Not to be rude, sir. But do you really believe that there is something superhuman that is responsible for these murders? I mean, couldn't it simply be a man who just... <laughs> there is no logical explanation. It is as I read. Yes, but uh, there's one important bit of information missing. And what is that? How can it be stopped? Killed. Dead. You'll understand from my book that there is it present resistance to his quest for domination, become his most desired conquest. So you deliberately left that part out because you were afraid he'd kill you too? My 
duty as a scholar to present all the facts is overcome by man's most basic desire, survival. Look, you've got to help us find a way to stop this thing. Simple. But almost impossible. Dismemberment. Head. Arms. Legs. Complete separation of all major body parts. Drop the evil flowing through his being. And, uh, just how are we supposed to get close enough to accomplish this small task? I told you. It's simple, but nearly impossible. It's been defeated before, and it'll be defeated again. Or else. Is there, is there anything else you can tell us? Do it quickly. Its power can spread almost geometrically. Well, <clears throat> we gotta go. Um, thank you. Thank you. you still follow on some medicine man's pot dream? Look, I didn't start out believing this shit. We have canvassed as much of that neighborhood as our fucking little feet will let us. We need help, man. We need help. I had known that you were still investigating some jungle hocus pocus. I would have yanked your asses off the street a long time ago. Now let's just get serious about this shit. Seriously. Hey, asshole. Find a guy or find a new job. You have to. You just go shake these jungle bunnies out of their trees and get some answers. Let's get the press involved. Something. Or maybe get the public involved. You know, maybe they can help. This could affect them also. All right now. It doesn't. Okay? So let's not go and create some kind of damn panic. What I need is some basic police work. Just find this guy before he unloads again. Okay, honey? Can I get some help? You want a tip? Stop looking for ET. Get some results. Dirk, you got a problem with that? We'll hash this out some other time. Where are them suspects? We know 
must be dreaming. You can't even find it, let alone chop the son of a bitch up. Who are we gonna get to perform this act? I'll do it. You wouldn't. You can't. Why not? Well, because what if none of this is true? What if it's human? So what are you saying? You don't believe this shit either? Car 17, we have a code 4 in progress. Proceed to LA 1520. We're on our way. <laughs> this murder weapon here. Good job, didn't get a nice job. Everybody okay? It ain't him. Now keep these people I know out it ain't here. Him. Get these people out of here. Uh, we can do it out you. Now get back now. Get them out of here. Okay, if it's early. Hold on a second. Um, we're gonna um, go grab a bite to eat. You wanna come? No, I can't. Okay, come by. Okay. Ugh. You sure you don't wanna come? Come on, you don't wanna be alone. I'll be okay. 
I just want to think this thing out. Are you sure? About what? That it was Roger. Yes, I'm sure it was Roger. What? Well, why? You don't... You don't, you don't think that, that, that he was the, the thing. Mm. Oh, great. How am I supposed to know? Well, just ask. You sure you don't want to come with us? You're not going to be in the way. Nah. Go on, have fun. Fun? How am I supposed to have fun not knowing whether it's the real Roger or not? Well, that's what keeps the relationship fresh. Peter. I'll help, okay? When he comes, we'll check him out. Discreetly. Oh, shit. Um. You don't seem to understand. No matter what we prove, it doesn't alter the fact that I wanted to kill him. I've devoted my life to science. You see what's happened? What good has it done me? What chance have I got to fight? Why should I be the one? Can you answer me that? Why me? Why should I be the one picked up for this? Please tell me why! I know how you feel, pal. a dinner date, not a drug bust. sizing me up for a pine box. No, no. Actually, we have a bet going. Really? What is it? I can't bet that you were... No, actually, I bet that you were 6'5". I can't bet that you were 6'2". Uh, so... Hey, guys, you okay? Why don't, uh, why don't we just order in? We can stay here. I mean, with this, uh, this headhunter thing's getting to you. What are you talking about? Hey, take it easy, Pete. I mean, maybe you just need a rest. I, I would. What is all this shit about me taking a rest, huh? Don't worry about me, Sonny. I'm up to it. This is gonna be like Dorothy in the fucking Wicked Witch of the West. Except you know what? I'm gonna piss on that thing. Meld it into a little puddle. Steam. Yeah. 
<clears throat> I suppose. You okay? Yeah. 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 Why don't I uh, cook the Chinese food and bring it back here? Okay, but I want to go with you. No, it's okay. I'll be right back. You be all right? Yeah. Just hurry. I will. I'll be right back, and uh, I'll tell you what. What? I'll bring you a surprise. What? You'll see. your mouth about something you don't know shit about, okay? What's the matter, Giuliani? The ghosts, the zombies got you spooked, huh? Yeah, one thing I know is there's no such thing in the real world, and any cop who thinks differently is dangerous. You got that? Don't believe everything you hear, okay? I'm fine. Yeah, maybe you ought to take a rest. I'm resting. Yeah, we well, don't go to sleep, asshole. Hey, Julianne, <laughs> so, uh, it's your lot. Big surprise. Hey, what the fuck's the matter with you? Hey, your mother ever have any kids that lived, you asshole? Harry, do it again and put it on his bill. Giuliani. Pete, I, uh, I just took a chance to be there. You there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm here. Look, give me a break. This is this is hard for me. Denise. I don't know why you're calling me here, but this um this ain't a real good place to discuss things, you know? Will you uh move to the house and discuss things? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, what's to discuss? You're my husband. And I... I want to talk. Please. You sound like me. I know. I know. You said the same thing. I know. Really, I do. I just... Please just come over and talk, okay? Okay, I'll, uh, I'll be over. What? Soon. Okay? Okay. See you soon. Bye. Thank 
drink or something? Uh, no. So, you doing okay? Eating regularly? Nothing different. What is this all about? I've... Uh, I've been talking to Murphy about how I feel. Feel? I, I don't know. Maybe this is a bad idea. Say what's on your mind, okay? Don't do this to me. I'm not doing it. Magic words to make things better, but uh, I want to make things better between us again. And I don't really know what that means exactly. It's, uh, it's, it's just a feeling. Look, if this is uh, left. Let's uh, be friends, pep talk. Uh, you're going to have to give it some more time. <sighs> I don't know. I just can't stop thinking about you and me. Yeah, man. Are you telling me? You want, you want to get back together? I mean, is that, is that what you're saying? Is that what you're telling me?
Boys! Oh, what do you need? I want... I want something in the building! Are you... Just shut up! Shut up! That! Hey, oh, what's yeah. that? Oh, that's a chainsaw. It's on sale? It's a gas in it. Oh, that's our it's demo. It's a gas in it! Yes, it's our demo. I'll take it, I'll take it. Okay. Don't you want here, 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 here. Take the fucking money. How much? That's all I got. I'll call you later. This is not. I'll be back. I got. Hey, what? Hey, what? Hey, what? Hey, what? Hey, what? what kind of a fucking business do you think this is? Sorry, sweetheart. I was worried about you. I'm sorry, that place was wrong. I'm sorry, you okay? Yes, I'm glad you're okay. Oh, man, it was crazy down there. Hey, listen. How about... How about... Why... Why don't we just have a little... Okay. okay. I'll uh, I'll turn on the TV. Okay. Uh, I'll warm this up. I'll be right in. Okay. Okay.
What the hell is that thing? I want to personally thank you for all that you've done for us. I really love this shirt. Uh, 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 just tell the tailor what happened. Uh, I'm sure he's going to fix it. You're okay, uh, Come on, guys. Uh, Come on. Up, up. Uh, okay. Uh, I got it. I got it. Okay. Pete. <laughs> Save the world or what? Yo! Yo! 